Talking tonight about an issue involving DUI. The guys that will help us out with the answer, as always, attorneys Greg Fellerman and Ed Saramboli. How's your year going so far, Dave? 2017 could not be better. It's an early year yet, I but agree. I agree. it's off to a good start. My Bang DUI questions post-holiday, you notice? So yeah. not for everybody, right? Some Jeez. people have some issues. We're going to tackle another one tonight for Bill and Ashley. Bill says, I have a suspended license for DUI. I got pulled over and charged with driving while suspended DUI related. What am I looking at? Uh, what does Bill and Ashley need to do? Bill, you're an idiot. <laughs> I mean, well, what, you know, first of all, you have, a, you have a suspended license for a DUI. I mean, we don't pull any punches around here. You shouldn't have been behind the wheel in the first place. What are you looking at? You're probably looking at jail time. At the, you know, days. You're probably looking at 90 days jail time. And candidly, you deserve it. Well, that was Ed's hard line on the law. But <laughs> there might be something that could be done at the hearing. So... He's right. I mean, you know, if you, if you lose your license because of that infraction, DUI, you should just park your car and get rides, use Uber. But sometimes you're able to work some of these out. Um, if for there, there's Sometimes there's circumstances that the police officer, the courts may, may work with you to get this. But at the end of the day, it's a 90-day sentence. I believe it's a $1,000 fine. It, and then you also lose your license for an additional, maybe another... Uh, it could be another year, and then again, if you get suspended multiple times, you can lose your license as a habitual offender for five years at a clip. I mean, it, and you're never going to be getting your driver's license back. So the lesson is, if you drink and drive, take your suspension, don't drive. Sounds like uh, Bill's going to have some time to think about things behind bars, but uh, for anyone else who has an issue out there, uh, they need to talk to you. How can they reach you? Uh, give us a call, 570-714-HERTZ. See us on the web, 714HERT.com. Yeah, I mean, the reality is people who are driving under the influence are more likely to be involved in an automobile crash than somebody who's not. It, it, I mean, it's, it, it's very simple, so don't do it. And if you do do it, then don't get behind the wheel again. Results matter. Attorneys Greg Fellerman and Ed Saramboli. Guys, enjoy your weekend. Don't forget, PAHomepage.com and the Law New Hotline are always there for you.